All right, with a VER, it's a lot like a quota with one important difference. With a quota, you consume more than you make because you're importing. With a VER, you make more than you consume because you're exporting. That's the only thing to really keep track of that's different here. So with the VER, we're putting a limit of 40 on the amount that we send out. Quantity supplied minus quantity demanded, that's our level of exports. Remember, the quota, that was reversed. Keep track of that. So plug our two formulas in there. So quantity supplied is 2P minus 40 minus quantity demanded, 120 minus 2 times the price. Make sure you put your brackets there, because otherwise you'll make a sign error. So 2P minus 40 minus 120 plus 2P. Collect your terms. 4 times the price minus 160 is equal to the VER of 40. So take the 160 over to the other side. 200 is equal to 4 times the price. That tells us that the price in our country with the VER is going to be 50. Now that we have the price, take it back up, plug it into our demand and supply. 120 minus 2 times 50, well that's 100. So that means we're going to consume 20 ourselves. Put the 50 into the supply equation. 2 times 50 is still 100, minus 40. So that means we're going to make 60 of them. And indeed, our exports, the gap between what we produce and what we consume, is equal to the level of VER. So we know we did the math right. Now you have your quantities. You've got your price in our country. You can go through, calculate consumer surplus, producer surplus, deadweight loss, all that kind of stuff, and you're done.